G'day, I'm Robin from Equip2 and today I'm going to show you how to check and diagnose your emergency stop system on a C4. This can be done on any keystrack machine that runs the IFM PLC. First we want to open up the electrical cabinet and check the emergency stop relay. So we open up our cabinet and on the side you'll see a emergency relay. With this relay, when we turn the key to the on position, we're going to get two lights come up. The two lights are our signal to our relay, that is UB and U1. When the key is turned on, that is supplying the voltage to the relay. And to get the e-stop system to run, we need to put the reset button. When that button's being pressed, it will send the signal out through the emergency stop relays back to the system. You'll then see two new lights come up, which is K1 and K2. The K1 and the K2 are two separate signals that run right around our machine. This is for a double safety for our emergency system. If you only have one light that comes on, it means one of your circuits there is a short in it. Also, this is a good way to test your emergency stops for schedule testing, as you can see when they have been pressed. If I press the emergency stop now, you'll see that the lights turn out. This is a good way to be able to test your emergency stops and also for fault, fault finding. This is the same right through the range on all keystrack machines that run the IFM PLCs. So that's how you check your emergency stop system on your Keystrack C4 or any other Keystrack that run the IFM PLC. For more information, visit our website, Equip2.